Welcome back to DevCon. Oops. Good morning, everyone. My name is Skyler, and I have the incredible honor of leading the amazing DevCon team. Once again, welcome to DevCon Southeast Asia. It's been two years since we last met for DevCon in Bogota, in Latin America. Two years of building, of strengthening, of advancing. And it feels great to be back reunited with you all. We are here this week to celebrate all that we, the Ethereum community, have accomplished over the last two years and beyond, which is quite frankly, a lot. And we are here to make progress through in-person collaboration and learning to continue to improve Ethereum and to use Ethereum to improve humanity. And we are excited for this reunion to take place in Southeast Asia. We chose this region because of its significant and growing impact in the Ethereum ecosystem. Southeast Asia is home to many OG Ethereum projects and communities like ETHKL in Malaysia, like Ethereum Singapore, have been established for years. And newer communities like ETH Pad Thai here in Thailand, ETH63 in the Philippines, Web3 Saigon in Vietnam, Web3 Together in Cambodia, and many, many more are also making strong contributions, showing just how vibrant and active this region really is. And over the past year, on the road to DevCon, we've seen inspiring energy and enthusiasm from all of these communities and more across South and Southeast Asia, with over 100 educational events organized by these communities, for these communities, to help grow awareness and understanding of Ethereum. And we're excited that with DevCon, we had the opportunity to support the visions and goals of these communities. And we're excited to be part of this ongoing journey and can't wait to see the impact this region will have in this region and beyond. And we chose Thailand to be the meeting spot with a big benefit of it being very internationally accessible and particularly having a relatively friendly visa policy. From Southeast Asia, we have nearly 3,000 people representing all 11 Southeast Asian countries. But Ethereum is global, and so should DevCon be. And we're happy to say that this is the most global DevCon ever. People have come from over 145 countries all six, six continents, and to all be here at DEF CON right now. And that's the strength. The strength of the Ethereum community lies in this diversity and the unique perspectives each of you bring. But even, through, but even though the, the Ethereum community consists of people from all over the world, from all different backgrounds and all with unique histories, those of you here the attendees of DevCon have a lot in common. We are future-pilled people. It's to say that we believe the future will be radically different, and that this future could be better or it could be worse. But that certain technologies could be better, uh, certain technologies such as Ethereum and the in in intentional development of these technologies have the opportunity to make the future brighter for humanity. And we realize that this better future won't automatically happen. We need, to, we need coordination guided by values that we believe in deeply. Values like open global accessibility, like censorship resistance, credible neutrality, privacy, verifiability, and building hard, durable protocols. We want to see a future where these values are embraced not only in blockchains, but also in societal institutions. And this requires taking wise, sometimes hard choices, and recognizing that while shortcuts are tempting, 
And while others may be more willing to take them, we should not. And this is not us moving slow. This is us moving with intention. It is this type of future-focused, long-term thinking that your fellow attendees here at DevCon share. It is this thinking that sets Ethereum apart. And to share more about what makes Ethereum unique, and to shed light on all that we really have accomplished over the past two years and beyond while working towards these goals, I would like to invite someone I respect a lot, a member of the Ethereum Foundation leadership team, Josh Stark. 